Hey, Lorianne here at our Freedom Within Studio on Sean Klein Road. I wanted to do a live today to share the answer to the question that I'm asked most of the time, and that is, why are you still doing TRE 11 years later and you've made it your entire career? Shouldn't you have shaken it all off by now? <laughs> and so, usually, and the normal answer to give is that, well, we have years and years of stress and trauma in our bodies and tension. And so it's actually going to take time to actually release all of that. And we live in an overstimulated world, so we continue to accumulate all the time. However, for me, uh, TRE being a body-based practice, it releases from the body and the nervous system. But for me, it's really been about the nervous system because I just feel more and more alive all the time. That is truly why I continue to do this practice. I understand now that the nervous system is actually at the core of everything that we do. It creates our personalities. I remember when I was a little girl, my father used to always say, Lorianne, you only have one speed and it's fast. <laughs> That's the only speed he ever saw me move in. And now that I understand the nervous system, I understand that that's why my speech used to be really fast. I was quite loud. And, you know, my parents always had to try to, um, to help me calm down. And I understand now that I just had a lot of adrenaline in my system and carried that all the way through until I did TRE 11 years ago. When I stood up, I felt my feet under me for the first time. I actually felt my legs and my mind was calm. It was mind blowing for me because I didn't realize I could feel that calm. And since then, after I did it for a while, what keeps happening is I keep creating more space within myself. I keep creating space in the present moment to actually be able to see my thoughts even my main thought themes, so some of my main thought themes are, you're not good enough, you're not fast enough, you're not um, smart enough, you're not all these things enough, has been a big pattern for me. Also taking responsibility for everything, not seeing that both parties are playing a part, has been huge for me, and just thinking there's something wrong with me. Those are the false core beliefs, everybody has them, those have been mine. And so having more space because my nervous system is finally calmer so that I, because I have less adrenaline in my system so that I can actually see these thoughts and I can actually, whoa, I can stop them. I can see fear. Before, fear used to just stop me flat. That was it. And I felt small, right? So it didn't take very much. But now when the fear comes, uh, I have enough space within myself and grounding to actually say, you know what, this is kind of scary, but it's okay. And it also gives me the space to sit within me. Because when these things actually come up, these thought themes, and when it's time to go in to really recognize something about yourself and acknowledge that, oh, that's not so pretty, but it's part of me and it's okay, I have more space to be able to do that. And man, when I come out of it, I feel so fantastic, it's empowering, because it hasn't taken me over or stopped me from doing what I wanted to do. Now that might take time, depending how deep a thing it is, but I eventually come out of it, and that's very, very freeing, and I'm coming out of it faster and faster. I recuperate, and I understand more and more that that's what's supposed to happen. It's just as natural. So this is all because my nervous system is calm enough, and the best part is, that even though my nervous system is calmer, I still have all the energy. You don't lose your sharpness. You don't lose your superhero skills. They just get better and deeper because now I don't get worn out or burned out by being busy. A lot of people see me as being busy, even though some days I'm not busy. <laughs> and it's just because of what I give off. It's become part of my personality. But now I don't get so tired or burned out because I'm doing it more from a grounded place and only doing things that I feel called to do. So the having more space within me also allows me to see what do I really feel pulled to do and what do I feel like I have to do from up here, from a survival state, I should be doing this or do I really want this and would love to do this? 
So those are really the main reasons that I keep doing TRE, because it's a journey of that, and there's no end to that. So I just feel freer and freer, to the point now I, I have my company here in the uh, in Thailand, Freedom Within, that I manage with my partner, Yaya, where we have regular shake-ups. And I just am so um, pleased that the name Freedom Within came in a few years ago when I created the company because that is truly what I'm creating for myself with TRE. And I know, and I have the pleasure of teaching people how to teach this practice. I have the pleasure of teaching people how to do it for themselves and have these kinds of experiences where it's quite life-changing. So if you're doing TRE now and you haven't gotten quite to that point yet, it's coming. So keep coming to shakeups and keep um, doing your own TRE and so that you can also come to this place. And uh, we'd love to support you and guide you in that. You can check out our Facebook page. We also have a two-day um, uh, training coming up which can be taken for your own use or to become a provider you can decide after the weekend thanks for being here have a great weekend so I from Chiang Mai Thailand